everybody, Pug Gaming here. Today we are going to be working on a tutorial on how to create and share theme mixes from the new Theme Mixer 2 mod. Now if you haven't seen it already, I have done a tutorial going through the basis of that mod. So if you haven't seen it already, click the link popping up on the screen now. So to demonstrate how to share and create our own theme mixes, let's start by making our own one. So I want to do this and I want to make a few exceptions. I want to create a theme with at least three or four different themes in it. Once you're happy with your selection, go back into the main menu, click on mixes and save the mix as a relevant name to what this is. For example, we're just going to call this test one. Hit save and this is all done. Now you'll need to go back to the main menu of City Skylines. Once you're there, click on content manager and then go over to the mod section. Once you've clicked on the mods, you now need to search for the name that you just named it. So ours is test one. Click on that and now we go to share. After a few moments, another window will pop up and we can now name this for real. So the workshop title will be the name of what your actual theme mix will be called. The description we can do a bit later on as it'll be much easier in the actual Steam Workshop. Untick the publish source code and now click on the thumbnail button here. This will open up another window whereby we can see preview image. We now need to add our own screenshot and then rename it preview image. So delete this one and rename our screenshot and this will now change on screen as our thumbnail. This is now ready to be published. However, before you click the publish button, please make sure that this is a worthwhile mix to add to the workshop. Check if there's any other suitable beforehand because otherwise the workshop will get extremely crowded. Once uploaded, you'll then be greeted by another window pop up. This will be your workshop item page. Now, straight away, I would highly recommend you change your visibility to hidden whilst you work on your edits. First edit would be to change the title and description if needs be. Now in description you can mention what this theme is all about and mention it's for Theme Mixer 2. TPB has set up this mod very cleverly that when you do create your own theme mixes and save it, they are stored in this location here. Now that's not such the clever part, the clever part is coming up. If you then click on to the name of your theme mix, you're then greeted with a few more files. Most importantly, this one is called Use Themes. Now this text file shows every single theme you've used within that save, which is fantastic for the next step. The next step is a bit of a tedious one, but it won't work without doing so. You need to now go to add and remove required items, and we need to add every single theme that's within this save. The quickest way that I found to do this is if you click on the subscribe items tab, press Ctrl and F to find within the Windows browser and then copy and paste the name of it and you can quickly find it on there. Another way around this would be to go and find every single item individually and add it to your favorites and then click on the favorites tab after. Either way work, whichever one is best for you. Click the plus on every single one and then you'll go back to the main menu. Now you've added on the themes, you also need to add on the actual mod itself as a required item. Add on the Theme Mixer 2 mod and then we are pretty much done. The last thing to do is just check over all the description and everything matches up correctly. Change your visibility back to public and you are ready to go. You can always check on the workshop once you've submitted it to make sure it's on there. Click under the map themes and you can sort by date order. If yours is successful it will be on the top of the list. But that's all from me, I hope this video has been of some assistance to you and I look forward to seeing you in the next one. Thanks for watching and all the best.